Today's verse is Psalms chapter 91 verse 1. Whoever dwells in the shelters of the Most High will rest in the shadows of the Almighty. Amen. Dear beloved brothers and sisters, God bless you all first. Amen. And yes, as we get into the verse, if I believe that I can do it, yes, I can, but I'll have to face a lot of obstacles, barriers and destructions, right? And there comes destruction one side and hopelessness another side and the devil will try to do everything to stop me from me reaching my destination. Exactly that is what is happening in today's people's life, right? But if I allow God to work for me, then who will face all that is against me? It is our God, Heavenly Father. Amen. Hallelujah. I will be safe if my God is fighting my battle so that I can rest. And that is what will exactly happen if I take shelter in the Most High. Amen. For I can rest and He will do the fighting for me. There is shade for me where I rest in the shadows of the God Almighty. Hallelujah. Doesn't matter whoever you are, wherever you are from, but God says, he is an open God for all his people, for everybody, no more under authority, but through the love of God, we are saved. Amen. As we read 1 Kings chapter 19, verse 8 and 9, the Bible says, He got up and ate and drank, strengthened by that food. He traveled 40 days and 40 nights until he reached Horeb, the mountain of God. There he went into a cave and spent the night. Amen. The Bible also says, the angel touched him and said, get up and eat to Elijah. There was bread baked on the coal and water for his thirst. So today you will not know from where your supply is provided, beloved brothers and sisters, but it will be provided in the name of Jesus. By any means, God is sending his angels there to make you satisfied. Hallelujah. This world was chasing Elijah. He was running for his life. Finally, his resting place was the mountain of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Where he found rest, peace and safety. He entered inside with his belly full, dear beloved brothers and sisters. So today you are safe because you have made God, Heavenly Father, your dwelling place. Where there is peace, there is provisions in abundance, there is prosperity and there is security for you. Do not worry. You are safe because you are in the shelters of the God Almighty. He is your protector. He is your provider. For those who believe, receive it right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. And let us pray. Dear Jesus, thank you, my master, for this beautiful day that you have given us, Lord. Lord, you are our provider, my master. We take refuge in your shelter, Lord, so that we find peace, prosperity, healing, and security, my Lord Jesus. All this is in abundance there, my Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Though this world will make us restless, Lord Jesus, you are our shelter. You are our resting place, Lord. No evil spirit will ever try to, to deviate us, my master, to put us into his plans, Lord, because we belong to you and your dwelling place is our house my master we live with you Lord Jesus and you are in us my master thank you Jesus for guarding us and guiding us we believe that this day is a blessed day my Lord thank you for manifesting in us thank you for the miracle that you're going doing today Lord we receive it in the name of Jesus and we allow you God to work for us so that you have fought the battle battle and gave us victory my master in Jesus mighty name we ask this prayer amen God bless you